congruency. Mental math, times tables, 7 times 8 equals 56. 8 times 6 equals 48. Addition, 85 plus 95 equals 180. Subtraction, 22 minus 64 equals negative 42. Division, 60 divided by 6 equals 10. Square numbers, square of 1 equals 1. The square root of 1 equals 1. Cube numbers, the cube of 1 equals 1. And the cube root of 1 equals 1. Decimal addition, you use your calculator to check all answers. 5,24 plus 6,07 equals 11,31. Decimal subtraction, 27,63 minus 15,16 equals 12,47. Decimal multiplication, 0 0,72 times 0 0,02 equals 0 0,0144. And decimal division, 3,2 divided by 0, 0,2 equals 16. We multiply both with 10 to get whole numbers. 32 divided by 2 equals 16. Fraction addition, 5 over 6 plus 3 over 4. Find the lowest common multiple. 20 over 24 plus 18 over 24 equals 38 over 24 equals 1 and 7 over 12. Fraction subtraction, 3 over 4 minus 1 over 5, find the lowest common multiple. 15 over 20 minus 4 over 20 equals 11 over 20. Fraction multiplication, 2 over 3 times 3 over 4 equals 6 over 12, simplify 1 over 2. Fraction division, 2 over 3 divided by 3 over 4 equals 2 over 3 times 4 over 3 equals 8 over 9. Congruency. For triangles to be congruent, the angles, sides and size must be equal. We have the first one, three sides are the same, S, S, S. Number two, two sides and the including angle are the same, S, A, S. Number three, two angles and one side are the same, S, A, A. Number four, in a right angle triangle, the hypotenuse and one other side is the same. The R is the right angle, H hypotenuse and the S is the side. Okay, now look at examples, congruency. Three sides are the same. We have two triangles, side number one, side number two, the yellow ones. And the third side is my green one. Congruency, now we have two sides and the including angle are the same, S, A, S. We have one side, our including angle, the green arrow, and we have another side, S, A, S. Congruency. Two angles and one side are the same. S, A, A. We look for the side first. Then we have an angle there. 
and another angle at the bottom. S A A. Congruency in a right angle triangle, the hypotenuse and one other side is the same. First we look for the right angle and there we see it at the bottom, then the hypotenuse and another side. 